நீயில்லாத நாளல்ல நாளாகுமா நீயில்லாத வாழ்வல்ல வாழ்வாகுமா First John chapter 5 verses 1 to 2 Everyone who believes that Jesus is the Christ is born of God and everyone who loves the Father loves his child as well This is how we know that we love the children of God by loving God and carrying out his commands We must love God we must love people and only then we are called born of God Showing love towards people is a mark of the redeemed people I say that because John in his gospel writes that Jesus is light, he is spirit, he is love. Love is God's predominant character and because of that love, Jesus came down to this earth. He came to redeem the sinners because of that love. He loved us so much that he did want us to live as sinners. He loved us enough to grant us eternal life. It was his love towards this world and the people that brought him down from heaven to this sinful world. He came down as a man in the flesh, suffered, went to the cross and died. All these have only one explanation, one reason, his love for mankind. The sacrificial love has been poured into our hearts as well. Everyone who is saved and redeemed has been filled with Jesus like sacrificial love. Why do we have such love? So that we can express God's love to his people. Next, he has poured his love into us and through his love he lives in us. He is not far away. It is true that he ascended into heaven but still he lives within every saved and redeemed believer. Hallelujah! He lives as love. Yes, he lives in us in the form of love. When people of this world see God's love and through us they see Jesus himself. They may not have seen God but they can see him through the love we radiate on this world. If you show love, if you love your enemy, if you have the love that can make you love anybody, then people who look at you will say, he or she is just like Jesus, dear people of God. We can see Jesus through love. Wherever there is such love, whoever can show such love to others, they are born of God. They are his children. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! God bless you.